Welcome to this video tutorial about the Dolly Bar ERP and CRM system. In this video, we will look at how to use the Take POS point of sale module in Dolly Bar. Prerequisites Activate the module POS Take POS from menu Home, Setup, Modules. You must also enable related modules such as third parties, invoices, banks, categories and products. Grant permission on the POS Take POS module as well as the related modules for your users. For more advanced information on how to set up permissions to users you can watch our video Users, Groups and Permissions. Creating an invoice via Take POS. The Take POS Dolly Bar module allows to make sales from computers and mobile terminals in any type of store, including bars and restaurants. The user interface is fully compatible with touchscreens, order printers, scales, etc. Begin by choosing a terminal. Choose the customer or third party. This is optional, so you can also stay with a generic customer. The recent invoices show up based on the time of creation. Click or tap on a time to load the invoice. You can also click or tap on History to view all the invoices generated for all customers. Click or tap on an invoice to load it. If you want to start a new concurrent invoice, click or tap on the New button. Choose a category. The respective products are loaded. Click or tap on a product to add it to the invoice. You can modify the quantity, price and discount. On the invoice, click or tap on a line item to highlight it. If you want to change the quantity, click or tap on the quantity button, enter the desired quantity and press the OK button. The quantity is now updated for the chosen item. Similarly, you can choose an item and set up a discount percentage for it. You can also choose an item and modify the price. Note that the price change applies only for this invoice and not for the product master. New or non-standard products can be added quickly by using the appropriate button. Provide a description, enter a price and choose a sales tax percentage. The new product is now added to the invoice. Note that adding a new product in this manner does not add it to the product master. If you use the module stock, you may also set up the module to decrease the stock automatically when a sale has been completed. Stock for predefined products can be made visible on Take POS 2. For more information on how to add products and allocate stock, please watch the tutorial videos on products and services and stock. Global discount for the entire invoice can also be added. You can add a discount by price or a discount by percentage. The discount has now been added to the invoice. The invoice is now ready for payment. Click or tap on the payment button and enter the payment amount as paid. The excess received is clearly shown. Now click or tap on the appropriate payment method. You can enter several payments for the same order. Once the total paid matches the amount on the invoice, the invoice status is modified to paid. 
Click or tap on the print button to send the invoice to the printer. Note that the payments, invoice status and the POS terminal used to generate the invoice are saved and visible in the main dolly bar interface as well. You can send the invoice by email, make a return or print a gift ticket. Using Take POS for a restaurant. You can also use Take POS for a restaurant to manage tables, as well as the orders for those tables. For this, navigate to the setup of the module Take POS and enable the feature for Restaurant. You can define the map of the levels, such as Floor 1, Floor 2, or Level 1 and Level 2. You can also define the position of each table with the editor. Use the Take POS module as usual for restaurants. The difference is that you can choose a table when you take an order and come back later to finish the invoice. There are plenty of other features that can be enabled from the setup. You can configure the number of terminals, format of the receipts that are generated, as well as the banking and settlement parameters for each terminal. For example, with Take POS Connector, you can print directly, use scales, etc. Thank you for watching this video tutorial. Visit www.dollybar.org to learn more.